Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Hello and welcome back to the channel. Today we have asked Elmo as he continues to harass cops at the Houston Police Department. Nothing new there. So I'm going to pep it up some and add a moron counter to the mix. I may do this every other weekend. So... Here's how it's going to work. I'm going to add one point to everything he says that's really stupid. Ten points for every time he mentions tyranny or a tyrannical act. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. What's going on, guys? Auditing America. We're in Houston, Texas, and we're at the police department headquarters. Beautiful building. Can you tell us what the Third Amendment is, ma'am? Do you know what the Third Amendment is? Are you a sergeant? Can I get your name? Badge number? It's your policy? Sergeant White? Sergeant White? Yep. Why do you get offended when we ask about the Constitution? That's the walk of shame. Ma'am, can I have your name and badge number, please? Oh, why? I'd just like to know who I'm speaking with. <laughs> what do you want to speak with me anyway? I'm asking you a question. I'm asking you. I'm going to ask you a uh, question per pertaining to your job. Why are you hiding your badge? You're, are you, you have I something, mean, you, have something you just walk, walked up to me for no reason. I don't well, know who, I don't know what. Well, what if I'm gonna, well, if I'm gonna, if I need help with groceries, I go to Walmart. Uh -huh. If I, if I need help with the constitution, I come to the police. <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't go to the police for the constitution. They are there to protect and serve. You go to the library or a constitutional law expert to get advice on the Constitution or study it, you blockhead. So imagine a Walmart employee questioning me, why am I asking him about where can I find tortillas? You see, you guys swear to protect something. You guys are public employees. And you guys get offended when we ask questions. That's the walk of shame. Man, are you a cop? Yeah. Real quick, do you know what the Third Amendment is? I'm trying to be nice, bro. I'm not trying to bash you. Oh, Give cool. a good name to the police department, bro. I've done nothing but peaceful videos here. <laughs> trying to ask cops about the Constitution. I'm not trying to give you a hard time. If you don't know it, I'm just trying to get you to go back and brush up on it. But well, these guys are rude as hell, bro. Yeah, I understand, sir. What, what do you think? It's the most important thing, right? The Constitution. Oh, yeah. It is the most important thing, what America's based on. That's what this whole police department is about, you know, that we're, you're, you're a nice guy. Right. Sir, can you tell us what the Third Amendment is? Are you a cop? You will never tell us what the Third Amendment is because you most likely don't know it, sir. I understand that you guys only get six months of training, but as a regular citizen, you're supposed to know your, uh, your constitution, sir, your rights. That's tyranny right there. Look at these cops. We got a Mexican cop over here that comes to the United States for freedom and takes people's freedom away. Right. What kind of shit is that? What kind of shit is that? What's your name and batch number? Why? Just requesting it. For what? For the record. Okay. Name is Wynn. Batch number 7780. 7780? Yes, sir. Thank you. And you, sir? What's your name and batch number? What's your name and batch number, sir? Detective Cruz, his police department, 6550. Thank you. Hey, Sergeant? No, thank you. Well, that's not how it works. You're a cop. You're here to serve the public. I'm the public. Hi, nice to meet you. Can you help me with some service, ma'am? You ever heard of a paparazzi? That's me. Oh. 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 She's going with the firefighter, huh? Yeah, so what's your point? Firefighters and police officers work together all the time. I've been a volunteer firefighter, and I know they work together a lot.
Are you a cop? No. No? Okay. You're not a cop, right? All right. Are you a cop? Ma'am, can I have your name and batch number, please? Can I have your name and batch number? You're a cop. It's your policy. You signed up to do the right thing, correct? You catch people doing the wrong thing. You see, you have to follow policy. Mm -hmm. What's your name and batch number? Thousands are watching you, ma'am. I know. Well, do the right thing. What's your name and batch number? You guys are all tyrants. That's why I'm exposing you guys. That's a lifetime sentence for you guys. And that's the walk of shame, ma'am. I know Fraud or the Troll has mentioned it in his videos, but there was a sudden jump cut right there when he was talking to that officer. What was said in that missing time frame? You should focus more on the Constitution and less on, on the sense of fashion. How long does it take to do your hair, ma'am? <laughs> hey, that's the walk of shame, ma'am. Sir, have a good day. They just walked straight through. They just walked straight through. It's us they don't trust. smile from this one all these personal vehicles yeah so what's your point all these personal vehicles Look at this window tent. These people think they can they can all break the law. Look, look at all these window tents. Extremely dark. Well, he scored a 44 on that moron count. So he's a real winner.